Funding for the First Lady series comes from Patreon supporters. To become a Patreon supporter, please click the link in the description below this video. Born at the Cedar Grove Plantation in New Kent County, Virginia, British America, Letitia Christian was the daughter of Colonel Robert Christian. Letitia was shy, quiet, pious, and by all accounts, selfless and devoted to her family. She met John Tyler, then a law student, in 1808. Their five-year courtship was restrained, and it was three weeks before the wedding that John first kissed her on the hand. In his only surviving love letter to her, written a few months before their wedding, John Tyler promised, Whether I float or sink in the stream of fortune, you may be assured of this, that I shall never cease to love you. They married on John Tyler's 23rd birthday at Cedar Grove Plantation, her family's home. Letitia Tyler avoided the limelight during her husband's political rise, preferring domestic responsibilities to those of a public wife. During his congressional service, she remained in Virginia except for one visit to Washington, D.C. during the winter of 1828-1829. In 1839, she suffered a paralytic stroke that left her invalid. As First Lady, she remained in the upstairs living quarters of the Executive Mansion. She came down only once, which was to attend the wedding of her daughter Elizabeth in January 1842. Together, John and Letitia Tyler had four daughters and three sons who lived to maturity. Their second born and first son was Robert Tyler. He married Priscilla Cooper Tyler, an actress, who at the age of 24 assumed the position of Executive Mansion hostess, and she served as official hostess at the Executive Mansion during the first three years of the John Tyler administration. At the outbreak of the American Civil War, Robert Tyler served as Register of the Treasury of the Confederacy. As the first First Lady to die in the Executive Mansion, Letitia Tyler died peacefully, aged 51, in the evening of September 10, 1842, from a stroke. She was taken to Virginia for burial at the plantation of her birth. Letitia Tyler appears on the 28P commemorative postage stamp from the Isle of Man Post Office, issued on May 23, 2006, as part of a series honoring Manx Americans. She also appeared on a one half ounce gold coin and bronze medal issued by the United States Mint as part of the First Ladies Program. Her coin and medallion were issued on July 2, 2009.